What? The hell, man? How much shittier can that asshole get? But just hearing your story makes me angry. So you left your hometown and you're living here now, huh? Huh, we might be more alike than I originally thought. I don't got a record like you do. I mean, that's not the point. I guess it's how we're treated like a pain in the ass by the people around us. Like we don't belong. I did something stupid at school before, too. The place you're living now is in Yongen, right? It's rush hour on the subways. I suggest you kill some time before heading home. What the hell, man? You barely touched your food. Just let me do it. I gotta thank you for helping me. Anyways, I got your back like you got mine from tomorrow on. As long as we do something about Kamoshida, I'm sure we'll both feel better about being at school. Oh, yeah! Tell me your number. Oh, chat ID, too. Just you wait, Kamoshida. We're gonna start right away tomorrow. First, let's hit up those guys that were kept as slaves. The volleyball rally's tomorrow, huh? <laughs> Shit's recommended by Kamoshida. Makes me want to gag. But, thanks to that, we got no classes in the afternoon, and we can walk around unnoticed. Well, I guess we can work out the details tomorrow. Come on, you gotta eat more! There's tons of ginger here! <sighs> I haven't been sleeping well lately. Whenever I close my eyes, I keep thinking about too many things. Shio. Nationals are coming up soon, so I keep thinking, should someone like me really be on the starting lineup? Don't worry. Just be confident in yourself. Your skills have been recognized. It's all because you work harder than anyone else. <laughs> yeah. Volleyball's all I have, after all. More importantly, was that injury okay? It looked really swollen. No, it's nothing. It's normal. Especially since the meet's coming up. Uh. Sorry to interrupt, Zui. Um, Mr. Kamashita told me to get you. Huh? What does he want? He didn't say. On, I... It'll be fine. I bet it's a meeting about the starting lineup or something. Yeah. Well, I better go. Yep. Good luck! Hang in there, Shio.
Welcome to the... I thought about resuming our previous conversation tonight. That is why I have summoned you. What are your thoughts? Are you becoming accustomed to this place? Ah, glad to hear it. It seems you have nerves of steel. Your rehabilitation determines if ruin can be stopped. Yet, such a feat cannot be done by you alone. But today, you entered a partnership with someone who awoke to the same power, haven't you? Involving yourself with others is an important foundation for your recovery. You've done well. That said, I am not advising the formation of superficial relationships. It must not be a frivolity, but a ring of those who would, by morals or faith, lend you their strength. In other words, they are bonds with those who have been robbed of their places to belong. The expansion of said ring will, in return, help you mature as well. Personas are the strength of heart. The stronger the bonds that surround you, the more power your personas will gain. There are countless people in the city who have talents that a weakling like you doesn't. You better rack that noggin of yours and get them on your side. We'll change that into power. Indeed, you should be prepared to use even myself, or your ambitions will not come to fruition. <laughs> We have a deal, then. I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast acquired a new vow. It shall become the wings of rebellion that breaketh thy chains of captivity. With the birth of the Fool Persona, I have obtained the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom and new power. All right. Continue devoting yourself to your rehabilitation. Now this conversation's over. Get lost, inmate. I can't do this. Hmm? Uh, 
pretty boring. Right? <laughs> Who cares? 